cost center. Let's go my line. Hello, call center, director speaking. Today, we have Adam22 making Lush shake like a wet dog, folded that boy like a lawn chair, and pressed that boy like an ironing board. Here we go. I'm... You're what, you're sorry? Cutting into that ass. Nah, like, I don't, like, what did I... Nice shirt in the back. I didn't say anything. Like... No, you said a lot of shit. Like, direct quotes. Oh! Some shit that I said only to you because... Because I fucking trusted you. Oh! Man, I. I... <laughs> oh! <I'm... laughs> it's only funny because it's like Adam is transitioning into uh into well Adam is transitioning no jumper into some whole other shit. Everybody else has a landing spot, and Lush has nowhere to fall but besides back on meth. And I knew, I knew, I didn't want it to happen because I don't pray that on no person. I knew that was going to happen, bro. I had a feeling Cuz was going to relapse. And I feel like this might be the time because it's like Adam been marking that nigga out for the past two, like two to five, two to five uh, Tuesday shows. Been marking him out and pressing him, make him look like a little hoe. And today he just full on embarrassed that man in front of the thing. Now. Do I believe he do I believe Lush did what he said Lush did? Yes. Why do I believe that? Because Lush was in the Lush be in the Reddit talking and defending himself. Anybody that's that pressed, I, I don't put nothing past them. Because at the end of the day, when you got an issue that's online, this is keyword advice for all the kids out there. When you have an issue online, your best thing is is to log off. Log off, go outside. Log off. Go outside, bro. Just go smell the air, bro, and walk or something. Like, don't even get on your phone. Because at the end of the day, none of that shit matters. It's all the internet. It's all the internet. Like, dead ass. Like, I'm the call center director, bro. I got a fucking V-neck on, bro, and no pants, bro. Who cares? But let me just break it down even more. House phone. When house phone left, he left with two real niggas. Blazzy. And he left with uh, Potlord. Blazzy self-made. Potlord self-made. So they go do Biggest Bro. Boom. Self-made. I got more faith in the Biggest Bro than I do out of Community and Back on Fig. Now, I think Back on Fig is the funniest one. But I got more faith that the Biggest Bro will do good. Will do the best in the long term. Because it's two niggas that's already solidified as self-made bosses. Not saying the rest of them not. But I'm just saying, like, Blazzy is getting his money regardless. Potlord... He's getting his money regardless. So house phone has a uh, has a landing spot. AD has a landing spot. Tyrell has a landing spot. Lush does not have a landing spot. Hell, Flacco even can go to the community if he decided to quit that other shit. So it's like, and Flacco self made too though. So Flacco wouldn't even. Flacco has a landing spot in his own thing. Like, I I just can't see it for Lush. Like honestly, I can't see it. I feel like this might be the end all be all for him. And it's a it's a sad it's sad, I guess, but it's like, bro, you gotta You can't be like like bro, if you're not in a position to be your own boss, do not if you're not in a position to be your own boss, bro, play your role. Play your role. All you had to do is like literally go to work and talk. Like you ain't gotta do no heavy labor, bro. Go to work and talk. And then it's like, bro, you made it so you made Bro, just do your job. Like, like if you're not in a position to stand up and stand out for yourself, then do your job and stay under the radar, bro. I don't even understand. Adam don't even be pressing nobody. That's the thing. Like, Adam will never press AD. Adam ain't, like, him and T-Rail get into it, but Adam ain't never press T-Rail. Shit, Adam ain't even press house phone. Like, he just argued his point, but he ain't press that nigga. Like, bro, this nigga's pressing you live. And I don't fuck with Adam. I want that to be straight. Like, I feel like Adam be on some snaky shit. I feel like this shit was low-key snaky. But it's like, if Lush did what he if Lush did what Adam said he did, I'm a, I can't do nothing but call a spade a spade. So, hey, my boy, I hope you land on your feet and start. Uh, I hope you don't, hey, I hope you don't cry too much about it, bro. That's all shit. That's all I can say. Honestly, that's literally all I can say. Keep your head up and, and uh. Shit, keep your head up and pray for the best, I guess. Um, 
How do I say this? The cocaine bot has uh got his circus wet, bro. The cocaine bot ain't computing no more, bro. The cocaine bot nigga ran out of batteries, bro. Anyways, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns regarding this phone call, please leave a comment in the comment box below and I'll be sure to get back with you.